what's going on you guys welcome back to my channel it's me your girl leah and today i'm going to be doing something completely different from what i am usually posting and so happy to be doing so so today this video is going to be sponsored by love win hair they have sent your girl a wig a unit and y'all know i have not worn a wig in years like literally years so i'm super excited to be trying this wig out. All the details are gonna be down below in the pinned comment and the description, so make sure you check it out and let's go ahead and get into this video. So right here is what the hair came in. They did put some other goodies in here, so let's go ahead and dig into this bag. They did supply your girl with some premium HD wig caps. Um, this is the case right here. Y'all know I already have opened it, so yes, they are already out of this, but they did supply these. I believe this is a bonnet. Oh, this is actually a shower cap. So it's lined satin on the outside and then it is like the water resistant or protective in the inside. So that's dope. I did not actually realize that that was in here. I got me an edges comb and brush. I've actually never seen one of these with the comb on the end as well as like on the opposite end too. I actually really, really love these types of uh, tools, combs, and I go through these little brushes. Once that buildup begins to happen, I just throw them away and use a new one. Y'all know they threw some lashes in here, so thank you for that. They also put in here an elastic band, and this has Velcro on it. I don't think I'm that far advanced to uh, using Velcro straps and stuff like that. I am very much a beginner amateur when it comes to wigs so we are definitely going to see how beginner friendly this unit is these are the wig caps right here and then it comes also with a headband so get into the good part get into the good part here is the wig it's like a honey blonde it is really really pretty um i probably should have put a little bit of combage and brushage to it because I have had it outside of the net. So, you know, when it's outside of the net, it'd be looking kind of crazy for a little bit. Anywho, um, in the inside, there is an elastic band as well. There are four combs. You can remove this elastic band. You can make it tighter. You can adjust it with the strap right here. And there's also a lining in the bottom of this unit where there's, it feels like almost like a gentle silicone. So you know it can like stay right at the nape of your hairline. Now y'all, this part is gonna be very interesting because I do not know how to do anything when it comes to a wig. Okay, so I can feel already that I maybe need to loosen this. I kind of have a big head, so hopefully this, head, this wig is big head friendly. I think I have a big head. Oh yeah, so it fits really snug, which is good. I'm gonna go ahead and put that bottom comb underneath. I think I could actually wear this without the elastic band. This is a 13 by four. I really wish I knew how <laughs> to really, really slick then lay down a unit. I'm gonna go ahead and turn my hot comb on right quick. So let me get this on, get it hot, and I'll be right back. I have hot combed the top of this unit and i'm really trying to decide if i'm gonna go with a middle part or a side part i have really been liking the way i have been seeing some of these side parts on the girlies outside but i know that my expertise is not on expert mode when it comes to these wigs um i do want to let y'all know that it is pre-bleached it is pre-plucked so this unit is ready to go and it does not need to be glued down. Great, because I am not gluing it down. Let's see what this will look like without the cap on. And I'm actually going to take this elastic band off as well. Y'all let me know in the comments, if you wear units, do you typically wear them with elastic bands? Do you typically wear them with the caps? How do you wear yours? What's the easiest? most natural way that you style yours or do you just prefer easy to glue it down have it on and do it like that because who your girl is lost in the sauce okay that's at my ears if i flip that out All 
All right, y'all. So I'm figuring this thing out slowly but surely. I am going to go ahead. I am going to use some concealer to make a more defined part because I am not using the cap. And I need to be able to see. I need to make sure that it is really in the middle. And I actually need to push these edges back because they are um, real in the way. I had to make sure these edges stay in poop. Hey, Sunny. I think I'm gonna go ahead and trim it. I'm really nervous about doing that. That's why I haven't done it yet. to put some of my foundation powder on like the lace that's right at the front of the hairline. We are finished. I think I look like Beyonce's younger sister, okay? So I'm feeling this wig. I think the curls came out beautiful. This unit takes really, really well to heat, which I'm so happy about because sometimes you never know what you may get and the curls may not always last. But I feel confident wearing this unit out, especially in this South Florida heat and humidity. And without a doubt, I will be putting on some spray, some holding spray to make sure the curls never fail. I am going to upload some shots in here from me taking pictures outside so you can see what it looks like in the daytime, in the daylight outside of my house. This is a easy and go beginner friendly unit. So thank you so much, Love Win. I love this unit. It really is putting me into like my dirty 30 vibes. Your girl turns 30 in less than a month and this wig is definitely a consideration for the birthday festivities. But y'all stay tuned for that. All the details once again will be down in the description. I am also going to pop some things up right here that you should know about the unit as well. And I will see y'all soon. Y'all let me know what you think about this unit. Definitely need to go grab yours. Click the link. I will see y'all next time. I'm adding this last clip in to show you all that this unit is truly glueless and you do not need to glue it down to secure it.